back in the supercar street racing living room today and this alien head right here has absolutely nothing to do with these ankle cut socks that we're going to be opening up and testing on the channel we're going to give you a good idea of whether you should invest in this exact same brand here warnies and we're going to do that all today on the channel supercar street racing stay with us Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the Supercar Street Racing living room where we have in front of me today this order of Warney's socks. And you can see right here in this pack you get 4, 8, and 12 pairs of low cut ankle socks. Now these are kind of like the socks that I'm wearing today. I wanted to go ahead and get another set of them so I would never be running short. And today we are going to open them up and see how they feel and how they compare to these more expensive socks that I have on right now that I did obtain from the store where I bought my on shoes from looking so fresh and hot today. So let's get some of these Warnie's socks out of the packaging and onto my feet after we take a look at what comes in the package and let's do that right now. Right in front of me right here and right this very moment right now, we've got these Warnie's socks. And as you can see here, we got 12 pairs for about $19. Checking them out a little bit closer and you see we have a four pack of solid black and they do say medium. On the actual ad for the socks on Amazon, it is a size number not a small medium or large so make sure you order the appropriate size for your feet so we do have right here right now four set of black four pairs four pairs of white and four pairs of light gray making it pretty easy to match with almost any of the shoes you have and as you can see right here I have on these nice on Roger shoes to test with these socks from Amazon. Let's get one of these little pairs opened up now and see how well they feel and if I think they're gonna be a good deal or not for $19. Back with the Wernies low cut ankle socks on Supercar Street Racing. And you can see right here right now that I did order the size that was size six to 10. So all these should fit anyone with shoe size six to 10. Now we have these Wernie socks all laid out nice here on the table. So what we're doing right now is just checking out the thickness. And they do feel similar to the other pairs of socks that I have that were bought directly from a designer store. I will go get a pair of those right here right now so we can compare the two on camera. Right in front of me I do have a pair of designer socks and I don't know the actual brand, but I did get I think about six pairs of these for 10 bucks at the store where I bought the on Roger shoes and feeling the thickness here and comparing the thickness to the Warney socks. The Warney socks do feel a little bit thinner. The question is how are they going to feel on my feet when I get up and walk around with them? But just uh, immediately, um, just slightly bit thicker on the designer socks that came from the designer store. And of course, all the different colors of the Warnies are going to be the same thickness. Let's go ahead and open up a couple more. And what we'll do right here and right now is just verify that that color and this color, these are all the same thickness. So let's do it. We have unsheathed all of the colors of the Warnie socks. And right here, we have a direct comparison of the white Warnies to the designer socks from the designer store where I got the shoes. And in feeling the material here, the designer socks are definitely thicker. By how much, it's hard to tell, but definitely probably more comfortable. But I have on 
the black ones right now, I'm going to throw a pair of the black Wernie socks on, take a little bit of a stroll around here and let you guys know what I think if they're worth the price. Now these were not provided to me by the company, so um, this is not sponsored, but if you would like to buy a pair, make sure that you click through my link in the description if you wanna buy a pack for yourself. It would benefit me greatly and the channel as we can continue to bring you good things like this. Now let's try these guys on and see how they feel. Got the Wernie socks on, the black ankle height Wernie socks on with the on Roger shoes. First impressions, they feel about the same as the designer socks over there do. They were a little bit more see-through, indicating that they are actually thinner. But as I walk around here in the Supercar Street Racing house, I am not seeing any noticeable difference in comfort. Now, these shoes are extremely comfortable. So let's preface that by saying these are amazing shoes. And we will be reviewing those as well. We just haven't got to that yet. But yeah, the first thing I can tell you is that the new Wernies ankle high socks are just about as comfortable, if not as comfortable as the designer socks that we got from the store where we bought the on shoes. Now what we will do is go into the Supercar Street Racing Studio and take a look at what's available online as an alternative to the Wernies, take a look at some of the reviews for the Wernies, see what people are saying about these and give you guys a second option or third option to order. And, but once again, the link will be in the description for these Wernies socks and a few other brands. So if you could do me a huge favor and go ahead and order that or anything else you need from Amazon through my affiliate links. You don't have to order what's exactly in the link. You can order anything through any of my links and it will give me a slight credit uh, and you know the channel is very difficult to finance so if you guys could please like and subscribe and go ahead and order products like these Barney's ankle cut socks through my affiliate links it would be amazing and we would appreciate you guys so much now let's take it into the supercar street racing studios guys welcome back to the supercar street racing 4k production studio where we join you in every video to kind of take a look at amazon down here which when you're looking it's right down on this side here and we will take a look at these warnings no show men's socks today so these were bought from amazon and there will be a link in the description for you to buy your own pair and as you can see right here this is a really high selling product Looking at the Amazon page here, we see these guys have a 33,249 rating with an average rating of 4.4 stars, which is not bad. It's really hard to get anything above mid fours in Amazon unless you only have a few five star reviews and some other lower ones. But if you can see right here and right now, there is 63 unanswered or 63 answered questions rather here about the product and 900 plus people have bought this in just the last month. So that's not bad for sales. Now they have a bunch of different color mixtures here. Now this is the one I got. So I got the, uh, this, this color here, but you can get them like this like that like that like that's pretty cool i might order a set of those they're only 16 dollars and then they have those 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 are also pretty cool so i think i'm going to go ahead and place an order for another set of these because i was pretty satisfied with the warnings ankle cut socks and if we go into some of the description here for the product we see that they are cotton or and or spandex, it really doesn't specify which they're talking about on which. It says hand wash only, which that's interesting. I, I don't know why it says that because I've washed mine in the washing machine already and we have no issues so far with the Wernies. Says they've got a three silicone grip heel, heel grip. Now, if you notice, it says that on all of these, but some of them actually say machine wash. Now, the ones I ordered right here, they say hand wash only, so I disagree with that because I've already washed the things in the washing machine. Now, maybe they're gonna fall apart from doing that, but um, these right here, like these say hand wash, these say hand wash, 
hand wash, machine wash for this set. So I don't know what the difference being on those. Now it says that they are invisible wear, so it says that they are going to not show with your shoes and they do actually show on my shoes above my ankle, so that's not necessarily true. And it says that they have a well-made cuff also, so that's yet to be determined. I mean, they feel fine as of right now on my feet. I'm, out, I'm actually wearing them as we speak and I have not had any issues with them so far. Now moving down to some of the reviews here. This five star says the right fit for my feet took a try on these socks and I don't like the bulky ones. They feel good wearing around the house. And yes, the elastic can feel a little tight. I don't really have that same experience with mine. Maybe it's a different version. One of the different um, uh, types available there from all the ones on the listing. And it says they're not truly no show. That is actually the truth. And you could see on my feet in the video that they are actually above my ankles just a tiny bit. This thing says they fit a little snug. This, is, this guy is actually saying that the larger size is the best, so he says to get the larger size if you're going to get a size for your feet. I bought the size exactly for my feet, and I haven't had any problems with them yet. Moving to some of the three-star reviews, we see, here, we see here that they're very thin and good if you're a minimalist. It says that they are small. Mine are not. Um, this says, did not catch that they are hand wash only. Not sure what that's going to mean in the uh, in the in the future. And this guy says that there's already hose, holes in the to in the toes. So look at that picture. And they're saying this is going to happen to you. This says cheap quality. You get what you pay for. I got some socks, similar socks at a fashion store for about the same price. So I don't know that these are actually super cheap. And this guy's saying they're too small for a 11.5 to 12 shoe size. So keep that in mind. And some of the worst reviews here, the one star, which is 5%, this material uh, says it's thin and the size run large, slips on skin, and bunches, creases, and folds. Have not had the same experience with mine, but then again, I bought a certain order configuration. Extremely thin. I thought they were close to my designer socks, but not exactly, so maybe check into that when you are ordering. It says they won't last, that they are garbage. Half of them are dirty and used. Okay, so this guy got, actually got dirty socks, which is interesting. Free shoe store socks. He says, you know that when you get them with sandals uh, for free, that those are actually cheap. This batch fit and wears poor, and they are too small, so small, lame sizes. So there you go. That's what we are seeing about the Wernies, and I think that it's going to take some investigation and some longer wear on these shoes to really figure out what is going to happen with them. Guys, thank you so much for being a supporter of the channel. Every little view helps. And once again, the link for these socks will be in the description of the video. It would help me greatly if you could click my links to buy anything from Amazon. It doesn't have to be these socks. You can click the socks link and then buy anything you want and that will give me a affiliate credit and it will help the channel just a little bit because I don't make money on the channel. I actually lose quite a bit of money. So your support means so much to me and the channel. We thank you so much for being here. We'll see you guys next time in the 4K production studio for Supercar Street Racing. I'm out of here.